Hi, I'm Dr. Casperson from Pacific Northwest Urology, and I'm here today to talk about nocturia, which means getting up to urinate at night. Nocturia is a huge health problem, especially as people grow older, and it affects both women and men. Nocturia is a medical condition, which is getting up to urinate at night. Nocturia is tricky because we want to blame the bladder for waking us up and making us urinate at night, but it's rarely the bladder's fault. Sometimes an obstructive prostate can cause poor emptying of the bladder, leading to more increased uh, urination at night. I describe it like a glass half full. If your bladder doesn't empty all the way, it takes less time for it to fill up and feel full, therefore you're going to get up more and more and more. Normal voiding is urinating two or less times a night. During the day you want to urinate about every three hours, but at night ideally your kidneys decrease their urine production because of the secretion of a hormone called DDAVP. Nocturia is multifactorial. It can be because of cardiac, pulmonary, fluid retention status, a kidney and hormone issue, problems with the bladder emptying, uh, overactive bladder can also cause getting up uh, to urinate at night. Getting up to urinate at night is tricky uh, to help, but there are options. When I see a person who is complaining primarily of nocturia, I want to know how their daytime voiding is because the daytime voiding can help me figure out is this an overactive bladder problem where 24 hours a day is uh, affected by their urination or is their daytime mostly uh, normal happy bladder, they're not having incontinence, they're not having frequency, and they really are plagued just by getting up to urinate at night. Behavioral strategies are no fluids two to three hours before bed, always voiding right before bedtime. If you suffer from swelling of the legs, seeing primary care doctor to address the swelling or at least elevating the legs for up to an hour before bed to try to get most of that fluid circulating through the body and urinated off before you then lay flat at nighttime. I also ask people about their sleep habits. Are other things waking you up? You have a noisy neighbor, a noisy dog, bright lights, uh, loud sounds, and since you're being bothered by this and waking up, you just urinate. Uh, because you're up. All those things can be modified to help. If you're truly waking up because of a bladder sensation, uh, then that should be addressed as well. I also ask if people snore uh, or have sleep apnea. Untreated sleep apnea can cause an uh, increased intrathoracic pressure, which causes more uh, urine to be cycled through the kidneys and can increase urine output. A lot of people, after they've been diagnosed with sleep apnea and appropriately used their CPAP, have decreased nocturia. When I see somebody for nocturia, we check their post-void residual, again, to make sure that their bladder is emptying all the way. We want your glass to be all the way empty when you go to bed at night. I ask them about fluid habits, caffeine use, alcohol use. All of these are diuretics and increase uh, urine production. I also ask them when they stop uh, drinking fluids before night and their sleep habits their cardiac status, any diabetes treated or untreated. There is a medication called DDAVP or vasopressin. This drug taken orally or intranasally causes the kidneys to decrease their production of urine overnight. This medication is taken at night so that the onset is just in the evening. There are rare side effects of DDAVP, but they can put you at risk, and the uh, risk would be hyponatremia or lowering of the sodium. So we do check people's electrolyte levels after starting this medication. In order to be diagnosed with nocturnal polyuria, which is too much urine production at night, we have bladder diaries and we have people record how much urine is produced at night, how much urine is produced at night uh, over the total 24-hour period and see what that ratio is to see if the kidneys are actually inappropriately producing too much urine at night.